Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Electricity. I'm here today to look into growth defects of plants and this particular plant is called a Diffenbachia and it is also called a dumb cane. And you can find this in most garden centers. It's a very common household plant. As you can see, it has very, very large leaves on it, about the size of your hand. So this is how they come into my house, and one of the things I've noticed is these plants are actually deforming for various reasons at my home. And I'm going to show you one of the reasons why these plants may actually deform, and that is right here. This is a grounding cable, and if we follow it, it actually comes over here, and it plugs in to the power strip. So this round connection right here is the ground and that's what this green cable is connected up to. And one of the things I discovered last year is that my grounding system has this very large AC waveform on it. And that's almost 4 volts peak to peak. And it's 50 hertz and it's coming from the ground rods and in turn that's coming from the utility system neutral. So the utility system neutral at my home is not actually a ground potential but instead is actually at the potential of a few volts. And that potential goes up and down during the day and generally is at its worst around 6 o'clock in the evening. So this will probably increase some more as the day goes on because right now it's only 4 o'clock on a Tuesday. So this experiment is designed to see what happens when you put a grounding connection into the soil. And as you can see, the cable's actually been stripped and it's actually got a little bit of copper showing. But that copper goes all the way through this pot. So this copper strands completely filling that pot and connecting the pot into my electrical grounding system. So I expect this test to take some months. So it does take several months for the growth cycle to come through on these plants to new growth and show the deformities. So that's the experiment. And let's take a little look at the frequencies that we can find on this. I'm going to turn on a function called the fast Fourier transform function. And that shows us the frequencies that's on the system. Right now we're on 250 hertz per division. So each little square represents 250 hertz in the horizontal direction. And right here, that big peak, is the 60 hertz. So that's the mains frequency. Everything else is some form of harmonic or noise in addition to that frequency. So we can actually see that there are harmonics on there. So it's going to be interesting to see how this range of dirty grounding system frequencies affects the plant. And as soon as I know the results, I will post another YouTube video showing you the results. And if you want to find out more about these plant growth defects, and more importantly, how it affects the human, you'll find it in Toxic Electricity. I hope you enjoyed this presentation, and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.